And this year's Academy Award for Picture of Health goes to Jane Taylor. Congratulations. How do you feel about it? Thank you. I never thought at 95 years old I would receive such an honor. I still get up every morning and put my mat down on the floor and do my stretches. Jane, you're such an inspiration for a lot of us younger people. Uh, what's your secret? I'm interested in what's going on in the world. I like to meet new people and hear their stories. I like to keep in touch with all my old friends. I like to keep in touch with younger people, such as my grandchildren and my great-grandchildren. Jane, what type of uh, activities interest you? Oh, I've always been interested in exercising, walking, biking, swimming in Lake Erie. For many years, I had a very demanding job. and. To relax, I took Tai Chi and stretch lessons. You know, I honestly don't think of myself as getting older, even though I'm 95, but the fact that I'm extremely vision impaired has limited uh, many of my activities, but I can still exercise and I enjoy every minute of it. And this year's Academy Award for Most Organized goes to Joe Cadwallader. <laughs> Congratulations, how do you feel about it? Thank you, it was the most organized award and it's kind of good to be recognized later in life. I didn't think I was the best of dads, but working all the time, uh, being a neighborhood do-gooder, but now that I've got grandkids and the little ones and especially the great grandkids, I'm trying to set so much better of example uh, for the family, for the little ones, especially to see that they know the Lord. Joe, how do you stay organized these days? Oh, when I was young, the clock ran so slow, and now in old age, I find that that hand goes around awfully fast, so I have to be organized if, if I'm going to accomplish anything during the day. Joe, what's a normal day, day like for you, and how do you stay occupied? I like to spend a little time with my wife, naturally. Uh, we play cards together and I spend quite a bit of time at the computer uh, working on uh, a Bible study. I wish I had been learning to read, try to read Hebrew. It's a wonderful language. I don't know, think I'll ever speak it, but I'm trying to learn to read some of it. I'm a two-finger typist, which means it takes me a lot longer to write a lesson or complete a study than it would someone else. And this year's Academy Award for Creative Mind goes to Janet LaBelle. Congratulations. How do you feel about it? I was pleasantly surprised and really appreciate the honor. I liked to sew and had to wait until I was eight to use the sewing machine and uh, made all sorts of things for the family. I've been making quilts for quite a few years when I could and uh, teaching two granddaughters to make quilts. One of them's very prolific now and doing them commercially and the other one's just learning. Janet, what do you enjoy most about quilting? The look on people's faces when I give them a quilt just fires me up, makes me excited, and I'm ready to make more quilts. 